so hello and welcome back to the channel in case you are new here my name is brian so about a month ago i did a video on ussd and django integration where i showed you how to actually build a microfinance application using django and the africa stocking ussd api so since then i've received a lot of requests of you guys asking me how did you build this can you show us how to build it so yeah finally i've been able to listen to your request and i'm going to release a series on how to build a ussd application using django the africa stocking api and intersend api so in this video this is going to be the first series the first video of our series so i'll be showing you how to set up an africa stocking account i'll also cover how to set up an intersend account that will be used for the payment integration for the mpesa sdk push and then finally we'll also be talking about how to set up django for those of you who do not know how to set up django yet so why do we need africa stocking and uh, the intersend api so africa stocking will be our gateway that will be able to offer us the api keys for the api integration at the same as intersend will be used for the payment processing so you guys can you also use daraja api but it's just for my personal preference to use intersend api i find them much more convenient and reliable as opposed to the daraja api but it's all up to your choice if you decide to use another payment gateway it's all fine the whole idea here is to show you how we can integrate django ussd and also the mpesa sdk push so without further ado let's get started and i'll show you the first step i'll show you how to integrate how to set up uh, the africa stocking account so you'll be able to register login and also get your api keys so personally i already have an account so i'll just walk you through the entire process of how you can set up your account login and also how to get your api keys so the first step over here is to visit the africastalking.com website then once you're here if you already have an account you can just go ahead and press login then over here you can enter your email address and then you can enter your password so for those who don't have an account it's pretty straightforward you can just click on register then you fill in your first name last name email address and the password and also remember to add a valid email address because they will be sending you a login code every time you want to log in via your email so really important to make sure you add your a valid email address where you can be reached so that is that once you have your api key, once you have your account set up you can now go ahead and log in so using my account over here i'll just come then i'll type my email address then you can now key in your password the password that you just created so okay so once you're logging into your africa stocking account so you can go ahead and click on the go to sandbox button then once you are here we want to choose on the ussd then you can go ahead and create a service code service code is that a star one for something code that you dial on your phone so in this case we are going to create one over here so just click on create channel then uh, so we've successfully created a channel so right now we have two channels I have one that I created earlier when I was making the fi the first video then I also have the second one that is the 326224. So once we have that you are now good to go. Uh, other things that you need to have are uh, things like the API keys so you can just come over here. You need to enter your password then uh, you will get your API keys which will be used for integration so just get them and save them somewhere. Then that is how we set up the Africa stocking 
account for the project the next thing that you need to do is to set up an intersend account and actually get our api keys so to do that you just need to go to intersend so just like that then over here intersend.com then for those of you who don't have an account you can go ahead and sign up just like that the full name email address and again it has to be a valid one just like we did in africa stocking a strong password and the referral code then the referral code is optional you don't have to add it but if you have one you can just enter there then the person who will refer you can earn some points so once you are done click on proceed and then log in so i already have an account so we'll just go and hit on login over here then uh, i'll enter my phone number click on next after this you'll be sent a token to your registered phone number then you can verify and proceed with the login so i already have my code here zero eight two two so click on next to login and there we are we are at our in uh integrations over here and then you can click on your you can copy your public and your secret keys over here then you can also set up a webhook if you are planning to query some transactions in your application so you can set up a webhook over here for your application and that's it for setting up an intersend account now the last thing is how to set up uh, Django for this project so we won't be covering setting up Django in this video I already have a video for that so I'll just link it in the description I'll also put it in the card above over here so you guys can follow that video along so once you have Django set up we will now proceed in the next video or now we can start setting up our Django models and views for the project so that's it for the video uh, I also want to mention that so that's it for the first series of the Django USSD integration if you like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up and also remember to subscribe if you haven't so i'd also like to mention that we have a podcast a weekly podcast that is called the dev cycle podcast where we talk about the latest tech trends and also some interesting topics with various guests so if you like it make sure to check it out i'll put a link in through the description also visit my blog brianoginga.com for more valuable in-depth tech insights so thank you for watching and see you in the next one